Best days are the days where you don't have to work. Uh, speaking of not having to work, I gotta work. It's, it's time to it's time to get to work. Time to get to work with some FTL. But I hope you all are having a good one. We were playing uh, FTL Harbor No Pause. We were working on our tearless streak revisit challenge, uh, where we go back to ships that we lost on previously or didn't do as well as I thought they should do, and give them another chance. So far, we have gotten absolutely shrecked. Uh, we've done as poorly or worse. And we had it in our first attempts. So we're we'll just continue down the list. I think I got one win on Zoltne and then two on Lanius B and two on Keshele. And they just lost immediately. So hopefully, I, I, I'm just not even sure if I need to keep revisiting things till they just do better and hope for better RNG or what. But for now, plan is just to go down the list. Um, so like I said, we've tried Lanius B, Zoltne, and Keshele. They've all done the same or worse than previously. The next one on my list that I had that I wanted to revisit was actually the Slug A, which I have it at A tier, and it only got three wins previously. I think the reason I thought this would perform better is because it's got a good augment to sell. It's got decent crew. Not amazing crew, but decent crew. But the weapons are pretty darn good. Breach 1 and Dual Edge is a pretty, uh, pretty good starting weapon system. To Infinity and Beyond. That's right. What's up, Flemmy? So a hard mode, no pause. Um... I'm not sure why I thought this one would be better. It doesn't have Clone Bay or anything else special. I guess it's just the fact that it's got something to sell. I guess it's got two things to sell since Anti-Bio Beam is not something I normally want to keep. So, uh, honestly, I don't know if this one will perform better. But, you know, with my RNG lately, uh, freaking Lanius B can't get more than B, uh, more than two wins. So, let's jump into Slug A and see if Slug A has got any better RNG than we've had previously. All right. What's up, RPG Nerdos? How are you doing, my friend? What's up? Not much. Ready to jump into FTL and probably get salty. That's what's up. Uh, if I do Shift W, that's what it is. Shift W, one, three, and I can swap that. Shift W, two. So my plan will be to not get crew kills unless we have a ship that's just really weak and susceptible to crew killing. That will be the plan. Can I get through here? Wow, to get to this exit beacon, I gotta go through every single nebula. Two, three, so that's four nebulas, which will get us two extra jumps. So instead of 10, I should have 12, I think. So I'm thinking I get 12 jumps here. Do I need to beeline it for there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So it looks like I need to beeline it with one extra jump. So if I go to distress, maybe we go this way and see if there's a store on the way or something. Nothing much, you're just sitting at work and watching your favorite FTL streamer. Nice! Is that me? Oh, You shouldn't have. Hey, first jump. Free engine hack with a missile. My favorite. Um, well, you go in weapons then, I guess. Ugh. Value point and shields. This is the reason why I actually don't like Breach Bomb 1 that much. It has to hit twice to even take down shields by one thing. Wow, four damage. Two missiles, four damage. What a start, man. No O2, no heal bay. That's a really crappy start. Okay, I better fix this quickly, though. Okay, weapons are down. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. This looks like a crew kill opportunity. Dee -dee -doo -dee -doo. Possibly, depending on how quickly he repairs his shields, but this is looking potential. Okay. Alright, we did get the crew kill. Beautiful. By the way, you you made a few visual things for your new sector mod. Want to see a small teaser of what I might see there? Sure, if you got a if you got like a uh like a uh, what is it called? Imgur or something you want to uh, share, go for it. Um, visual things for your new sector mod. All right, teaser. So I see the edge of what looks like a giant space station or something. I like the background. Looks. I love space backgrounds. Space backgrounds are just my favorite. So cool. Nice little teaser. I look forward to checking that out when you uh, when you drop that development bomb. So eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I still have one more extra jump I can get here. Looking for a store to sell things, basically. I guess I could have gone the Distress Beacon for a chance at 
Dan alien spiders with anti-bio beam, but oh well. He's got an NG. What if I shoot shields first and then go for breach bomb? Would that be better? That might be better. Problem is I'm never gonna keep this down with an NG repairing. Let's do this. This should pull the pilot. Here we go. Yeah, God, so, so fast on his repairs. Uh, nope. Hmm, I gotta hit something else to pull the pilot. There it is. Jeez, I'm using so many bombs, man. Okay, thank God. That started a fire? No, okay. About to try to get out. There we go. God, using so many bombs. I don't know. I, I think I already immediately regret thinking this ship was A tier. We're just gonna run it. It's like it's got it's got kind of the uh the rock A problem where two shots is not enough and a breach bomb is not enough support. Okay, there's store. Two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I actually don't think I get that many jumps. The store, because it doesn't connect here, makes me think that would actually be a dive. There are some handy tutorials to make nebulars and atar fields yourself. It is hard to make them look different, though. Interesting. Okay. You wish you were that good at making visual stuff? Uh, the background is from FTL. Gotcha. Um... Is it worth going to the store to have a potential dive? I'm pretty sure I don't get three extra jumps from four nebulas. If there were one, if there was one more nebula, I think I would be able to get that store without diving. If we get a good enough weapon, it will be worth. So oh, let's go. I only have 34 scrap, but I have an anti-bio beam and a slug repair gel to sell. So if I get a heavy laser or something. No heavy laser. You know, charge ion might just be a good buy right here. I think I actually take charge ion here. Automated reloader is something too to fire faster. I'm going to go ahead and do this. This is a big upgrade. This will help us guarantee get through shields a lot better. Not sure that that's worth a dive, but that's going to help us. All right. Big old fat empty jump. I could go this way and not dive, but we're going to get so many extra jumps going through the nebula that this is, this is definitely the play. Offer my services. I'm not properly equipped. Oh man, if this is the potential... Uh, you know, I'm going to manually search. Nice. Freaking nice. Now I kind of wish I hadn't gotten that, but this is fine. This is fine. Dual laser plus whole laser is... Whole laser 2 is probably way better than what I was thinking I was going to do. Uh, so, alright. Because that is now just, what, five shots? Perfect. It's fine. Do, 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 do. Thank you for no doges, by the way, sir. Okay. Um, let's get one more weapon train. Actually, I have nobody to weapon train. Let's just do this, I guess. Pop, pop, pop. So, manually searching the wreckage just got us a free weapon. That is a chance. I think it's a 1 in 4 to lose crew. So, if there's another one of those same events, I would want to get level 2 piloting. But I kind of don't want to invest in level 2 piloting. I think what I'm going to do is get 1 power. And then we're going to work towards second shield next. Because we spent... I spent a decent amount to upgrade my weapons and then just got a free weapon.
Okay. Whew. All right. Thank God for Heal Bay. Inventing humans. Jeez. Who needs crew when you got guns? Me. I need crew. Because that can happen right there. You can get free, 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 four free borders. Free, 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 free. Four free borders. It can just happen. We are diving here, though, so I committed to a dive earlier. Oh, God. Don't hack my weapons or shields. God, 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 God. Okay, thank goodness. But we have to let this ion through. Whew! Perfectly timed. Get wrecked. <laughs> All right. Do, 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 do. Get breach shields. Do, do, do. No dojing training that we can get, so let's go into weapons. Bum, 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 bum. Pop, 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 pop. Fizz, fizz. Oh, what a relief it is. Hey, golly. Wow, okay. Holy crap, we've gotten some weapons, Sector 1. Well, I guess I didn't need to buy that charge ion. Definitely. I'm going to have all these weapons, and I'm just going to be diving and die, probably. This is, like, such good weapon RNG. And because I went to that store and committed to a dive, I might just die here. So... Oh, that would be such a kick in the pants if that happened. Don't hit my shields. Don't hit my shields. Okay. Jesus, that's a two damage missile. Oof, really good dodges for him. Damn it, man. There's a fire somewhere. Didn't it hit in this room? Oh, God. Oh, man, good dodges. Okay. There must be a fire in another empty room because it's not in any of my system rooms. Unless it's in their ship. Okay. All right. I don't know why I was hearing a fire, but I don't think I hear it anymore. We can, we almost have enough for a second shield. The question is, do I want to get second shield or more dodge for the dive? I think shield is probably still better. Oh, he's running away with a freaking goddamn piece of shit missile. There we go. There's some early morning salt for you. Don't you hit my weapons. Okay. Actually, shields probably would have been worse, but that's fine. Of course he gets two shots in, why wouldn't he? Running away with a damn missile. So we've taken 11 damage, I'm pretty sure... 8 or 9 of it at least has been from just goddamn missiles, so... Cool times, man, cool times. What a fun and balanced fair game. Enemy has a missile, GG they win. GG damage has been done. GG, no no counterplay. No counterplay, enemy just has missiles, so no fun for a player. Alright, 54 scrap, I can get the shields. I need one more power before the exit beacon if I can, but man, without without good our weapons are, I really hope we can survive the dive, man. This guy can't do damage to us. So is there any way we get a crew kill here, then, is the question. Possibly. Switching switching dual lasers out for breach. If we get a fire in the shields. It's not a fire. Wow, he just insta-repaired that. He's got a repair drone, 100%. There's a repair drone sitting right there, I can tell, because he's repairing it there. That's a fire. OK. 
Okay. Now we've done too much damage to probably actually crew kill this. I do have to use a bunch of bombs to get the crew kill here. Hmm. Might be worth, though. Okay. Okay. Seventy health. It's gonna take me two more bombs to kill him. Nobody on piloting. Of course he would dodge. You know, why wouldn't he? All right, one bomb, one dual laser will kill him. There it is. All right, I got a double reward. I hope that was worth the friggin' seven bombs I spent for it. Jeez. Okay, so going into a dive. Dodge and power, I guess. This is actually faster. Um, you know what? What about this? Charge ion, dual laser, heavy laser. We'll charge faster. We're going to put our O2 into our engines and hope we survive the dive, because we have so many weapons. We might just die from the dive, though. What's your weapon system? It's pretty good. Do this. Okay, alright. Didn't completely kill our engine, so that's good. We got the flak offline, which is amazing. We're taking this A as B. There's no way we're dodging this, sadly. F you. Okay, alright. Freaking breached weapons room, man. Can't fix that before dying. Oh man, let me get out, let me get out, let me get out. Oh god damn it. Oh, Alright, abandoned. Six damage from that and some amount of damage from the actual uh six damage from the ASB and some damage from just the black, I think. Just ouch, man, just ouch. Oh we didn't die from the dive, but oh my god, are we are we hurting? We are freaking hurting right now, man. We need a free repair or a, just a store. I have so many. I have so many weapons. I can't fit them all on my bar right now. Now, hey, at least we got some abandoned music to enjoy our stay as we try not to die here. This is only sector two, so two shields in our weapon system. We should be like super, super well. Set up to deal with any ship in this sector too, but oh, we paid a heavy price in hull to, to to be here. All right, there is an immediate store. Do I want to go to an immediate store? I think I take one jump store then here, just to try to get a little bit of scrap before going to the store. Attack the ship. Can't do damage to us. Perfect. Beautiful. You are unable to do anything to us, so we shall kill you. Nope. You gotta offer me way better than that if you want me to accept your surrender, sirs. Beautiful. That was not that much scrap. Okay. 
Better not get hit too much. Now watch several rocks with several rockets come along. Well, we're in an uh, abandoned sector, so that's not very likely. Oh my god, just more insane weapons. I I honestly feel like flak is a bait. But who am I kidding? I see flak, I buy flak. Flak, dual lasers, heavy lasers. This is about as good a weapon system as you could ever want. So there we go. We're just gonna. I'm just gonna snap take that. All right, our weapons are set up for the next like four sectors. So I just need to get systems and crew now. Attack the vessel. Can't do damage to us. This is just such an insanely good weapon system. Problem is we just don't have missile defense. So missile defense systems crew. Those are the three things we're looking for here. Crew would be amazing. Free crew would be just absolutely amaze balls. There's that word again. Maze balls. Check. Oh man, you have hacking and a missile. Let's see what you do with that. Okay, not my weapons. That means we're basically guaranteed to take the missile shot here. Hey, Jaeger Wilhelm, thank you for the 22 months, my friend. You rock. No weapons for you. We also don't have good doors. What are you talking about? We have level 2 doors. That is like, this is one of the few ships that actually starts with upgraded doors. It's the one thing we do have. Like, it's not max level with somebody manning them. Well, it's not that. True. Very true. Okay. Man. Yesterday and today, I, it's interesting to see people who have been subscribed for so, so long who just lurk, who never say anything in chat. I'm like, wow, that's amazing. There are people who watch my stream who don't chat all the time. The quiet, the silent majority. All right, this guy can't do damage. Good. This ship stole the doors from Rock B. <laughs> Rock B has no doors because this ship stole them. You know what? That sounds like something some slugs would do. I, I believe it. 100% believe that. Someone needs to man the doors. Doorman, a.k.a. butlers, are in this game. <laughs> yes. And their name is... Uh, what's the butler from... Uh, from Clue? I butlza. Um, oh, what is his name? My brother was watching Clue over and over in the recent past when I went to his place and... It's Tim Curry. Tim Curry is the is the actor's name. Breach Palm Mark Two. Okay. Uh, but what is the actual character's name from that? Oh, I can't remember. Mr. Body was the guy who pretended to be the. I think Mr. Body might have been his real name. I don't know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's do that. But yes, Tim Curry is the only butler I know of. Come join my crew, for the love of God. Nice. Uh, al although your only training is the only one I don't want you to be in, so... Um, Alright, you're on weapons for now, sir. Because I do want a slug pilot for the mind control immunity. Wadsworth! That's right, Wadsworth. You got it. Should have known. Show gets around, he'll know these things. Wadsworth. Intruders on board. I'm a butler. I buttled, sir. Butler's in charge of the something, something, and something. The front room, something, and something else. I learned what butlers do from the movie Clueless. Clueless? Not Clueless. <laughs> the movie Clue. Clue and Clueless, two totally different movies. I'm going to the one place that hasn't been corrupted by capitalism. Yes, yes. Tim, I'm going to the one place that hasn't been corrupted by capitalism. Curry, question mark. Uh, is that a reference to something? That must be a reference to something. He acts in Blue's Clues. What? Tim Curry's in Blue's Clues? Alicia Silverstone taught Rand all about butlers. That's right, Alicia Silverstone and Clueless. Taught me everything I know about butlers. 
Which reminds me of a uh, a one-liner joke from uh, Mitch Hedberg, I think is his name. Because I recently saw a commercial that said, forget everything you know about slipcovers. So I did. And then they tried to sell me slipcovers. I had no idea what they were talking about. <laughs> uh, I don't know what slipcovers are, but I, I know that joke because I just have watched his comedy too many times probably. One, two, three, four. Uh, let's see here. Uh, actually, I, I don't want an alternate trade because I want to sell you my missiles. So thanks for that. Thanks for that trade. And there's the store I can't get, sadly. We're not diving two times for another store. Truders on board. Jesus. The never-ending human borders. This is the third human boarding, human boarding event we've had so far this run. That reference was to Red Alert. Oh. Okay. Yes, that makes sense. But I don't know what Blue's Clues. Did Tim Curry... He was in Blue's Clues? But yes, uh, Tim Curry played like the Russian leader in... Uh... In Red Alert, so I do get that reference. I just don't get the Blue's Clues reference, honestly. Oops, not fully healed. Okay. What's up, Spectre? How are you doing, my friend? Appreciate the good luck wishes. I need it. I need it with how these runs have been going lately. You got vaxxed. Grats. Free speed hole. Uh, I fixed the speed hole. What's wrong with me? Congratulations on the Vax. Okay, you can't do damage, but you can board. Come on in so I can vent you a... Enter the ship so I can vent you a second time. Yeah, Blue's Clues is a cartoon. With the little cartoon blue dog. So I just, I don't get the Blue's Clues reference. Unless he was just in Blue's Clues which, on on that show one time or something. I don't know. It's going to be hard to get a crew kill. Unless I want to use a Breach Bomb. Just, just kill him. Blue's Clues is augmented reality. That makes even less sense to me, but okay. Cool. Uh, let's see here. What do you got here? Don't have missiles to s trade because I just sold them. Nebula or Mantis? Um, probably Mantis. I don't have long range scanners for the Nebula. Yeah, so let's go Mantis. Let's get even more borders to deal with. Well, hopefully we can get some free crew by going to the Mantis sector. I want to upgrade my doors. Not really. I want to save my scrap because if I can get cloaking, which we're really close to with the breach bomb to sell. That would be really, really nice. This exit beacon location is pretty darn bad for jump numbers. You put you put on a clue and you're watching it now. <laughs> I'm glad I can be a negative influence. Wait, that's a positive influence. That's a great movie. Um, I think, is that the movie I, I went and watched? <sighs> there was a, uh, there was an event that I went and watched a, a movie at like an old theater with my brother down in Temple, which is south of Waco. And I think Clue was the movie we watched down there. That's a good movie. Definitely a classic. Uh, this is 50-50 lose crew, I think. I can't do that. I can't take a 50-50 on crew loss. You're getting your first vax on Monday. Nice, Vega. It's awesome to hear. People are getting that done. It's just a load off your mind when you get that done. Nice. 
You got lucky with wait times? Nice. Okay, so we've got a fire burning the weapons room down. So there is a potential for a crew kill here. If I'm patient. Ooh, yes. Yes and yes, I will take a free rock crew. That is awesome. There we go. That's the kind of that's the kind of deals you gotta make. Free slave, my favorite. Wait, what? No, I don't I do not promote slavery though. Six jumps. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, you have a missile and hacking. Damn it. And you're running away. God damn it. Okay. At least didn't hack my my weapons. Gotta go. My weapons are insane, but I still just don't have missile defense, so. And he has a million percent dodge. Thank God we dodged his missile, though. Yeah, my next shot has to go for piloting, or else he probably gets out. Okay. Can't dodge the next shot, though, so that's good. We actually dodged two out of three of his missiles. Get wrecked! I still hate you and think you're unfair and imbalanced, but get wrecked. Get blasted, sir. Uh, duh, you're free slaves into indentured servitude. Totally different. Yeah, there. We force them to work on our ship, but it's not slavery. Because they could totally leave if they wanted to, but I'm just not letting them because I make it so good that they don't want to. Okay, so we're hoping to find a store with cloaking or hacking. It's our next goal here. Okay, you can't get through my shields unless this drone is insane. Okay, it's defensive drone, so he cannot get through. Is there a chance that we could crew kill this? I don't think so. Fuel bay a potentially a... Uh... Yeah, there's a repair drone. Sell this door open. I synced it with my eyes. Synced it with my own eyes. Keep trying to put power in here and it keeps having these dumb pop-ups. How do I not have weapon training yet with how fast these weapons fire? Guess you just started learning, huh? They can choose through the to leave through the airlock at any time they choose. That's right. It's your choice whether you're a slave, really. One, two, three, four, five. Actually, I get all these jumps. Okay. You're free now. You may work on this ship or get vented for free. <laughs> your choice. I'm not forcing you to do anything. That's not what I want to fire that. Good dodge, man. We've been dodging missiles like a freaking champion. Way to go. Magna Carta. I mean, Magna and Kara. Apparently my my two slugs are fans of whatever the Magna Carta was for, an ending to some war or something. It's a history thing that I forget. All right, 192 scrap. We have enough for cloaking, man. All right. Um, do I want to invest in anything else? We'll probably just save it all for the store, because what if they have cloaking and hacking? What if I could get both? Why not both? Yay, don't hack my weapons. Don't hack my weapons. Okay, it's fine. First laser two. Pretty strong, though. Good dodges. All right. We got a fire in the weapons room. Perfect. Pop. Got crew kill this with the fire. He's got a clone bay. Not likely. Crew killing is hard when you... First world problems. I can't crew the kill. I can't crew the kill. Can't kill the crew. Because my freaking weapons are too strong. And that's a free mantis. Oh boy, it feels good. It feels good to get crew and have a actually actual good weapon set up. This store exit. Uh, 
All right, what you got? You got a bomb, and you got a border. And I got a mantis deal with your border. Whew. Thank God he didn't stun my guy in the uh, no O2 room there. Get pop 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 popped. 22 scrap, okay, not too bad. Alright, I know I'm banking a lot of scrap, but it's all for this moment right here when you have cloaking and hacking, right? Right, store? Oh, they actually do. Okay, uh, and I can afford it. I could not sell the breach, but I'm going to sell the breach because we're going to need power. Damn, do I want... Now I have a choice, hacking or mind control, because I want both. Um, am I more afraid of guys with a bunch of shields or boarding? With this mantis, I think it's probably just hacking. Oh man, we are strong. I do need power, though. Funny thing, Rebel... Rebac fighters? I'm going to guess that means rebel fighters have vents on the right side, but they are useless because no doors. It's a Rebac fighter. I don't I don't know what a Rebac fighter is. Abandoned four. Damn. So taking abandoned three, or no, Mantis three. Reads, if I go abandoned four, which can have um, Lanius borders... Gives me a choice, but if I go to NG Homeworlds, I might have a forced abandon four. I'm gonna go NG Homeworlds. Buy the mind control and convince them to give you hacking. <laughs> that was the play. Darn, should have done that. I'll connect over here. Yeah. We have 50% slug crew, so we have decent anti mind control. Well, I don't know if that's a good thing, because all three of these guys getting mind controlled is probably the worst option. Low on fuel. Maybe you should have bought fuel at that store. Hey, selling missiles for scrap is huge, though. There is a store. I don't think there's any a chance we, any chance we get anything useful, so I'm going to get power, because we just need power right now. Ignore the tarp. We're going to cloak that bomb. Damn, I'm so slow here. Okay, that's a good deal. Well, that was, what was that, an 89% chance to dodge? 89% hit, cool. Well, it's only one damage, it's still, it's freaking annoying. Okay. This might be a crew kill, honestly. Once that guy gets low enough. Perfect. Come on. Okay, I was going to say. He, you're, you're dead. There's nobody to offer me surrender, you dumb game. Who is surrendering me? Who is surrendering to me? You're all dead. Okay. So I'd love to get backup battery from the store if that's an option. Uh, I will buy three fuel, yes. Seven, eight, nine, okay. Energy free stuff? Uh, it's not free stuff, but it's a cheap NG. We're in an NG sector, and without an NG, we actually miss out on a couple blue options, so I have to take that deal. It means I don't go to the store now, though. And that does give a silly device. That was a weird thing with his pathing there. All right. Praise be to the silly device. Actually, let's have you go over here. 
How's that for doors, Max? It's been a while since I've seen you. Good to hear you're still a fan of the doors. Yeah, we just don't go to the store since we spent our scrap on the NG. I was hoping to get free stuff, not spend my scrap on stuff. The onboard funeral system sends an offer of surrender to retrieve all crew bodies to bring them home. Okay. I'm waiting for the pulsar. Okay. I did not mean to hit that. I meant to turn that on. You're dead. Get wrecked. Get wrecked by this fully armed and operational battle station. Or just the fact that my weapons are OP as hell. No, don't pulsar my doors. What will I do? Alright, well, I definitely don't want to run before um, my shields are up, though. Okay. Giant alien spiders are no joke, man. I like my crew. I don't want to do a 50-50 on losing one of them. You also have a flak one and a mini beam. Your weapons are honestly pretty darn good. If I could crew kill this guy, actually. Because these two guys are dead. They're in a fire. If I hacked their heal bay, I would probably get a crew kill. Let's do it. If I can get there quick enough before he heals. There it is. Nice. Not sure if that was worth, but hey, we, we, we did it. We did it, Reddit. We did it. Is one drone part worth that reward? Well, it's potentially better rewards with a crew kill, so... What we didn't get was fuel, which is probably the reward we actually wanted. Manage a lot of crew kills with spikes on the bio beam. Yes, it shows again how not that good bio beam is. Honestly, you can often get better crew kills without it because fires and stuff are better than uh, bio beam for crew killing. Because what you can also do the bio beam can't do is um, take out systems that would do damage to you. Oh, man, I think that's not a dive. God, I have cloaking, so I'm going to go for this potential dive and hope it's not a dive. Okay. Was there a bio bomb? Uh, Breach Bomb is probably the closest. Breach and Fire Bomb would be the closest to a Bio Bomb. But there's nothing called Bio Bomb. Whew! So many free weapons, man. It's not a dive. My greed pays. Greed pays. I just realized the person who person who said buy the mind control convinced them to give you hacking's name is help me. I'm twitching. I didn't even <laughs> I didn't even notice your name. I like your name, by the way. Shouldn't for 19. That saves me six scraps, so sure. Low on fuel. Ah, thank good. Thank God. Thank good. No forced abandon. Actually, Rebel Stronghold's awesome. Problem is, we need to actually find, uh, actually find the 
thing. We know the quest beacons are not the under construction flagship. I need fuel though. What's up, Plunder Pig? How are you doing, sir? Sure. Please don't be a person who's out of fuel in this distress beacon. Jesus Christ. Okay. Well, um, if this is the fake quest, then we are 100% waiting for stuff. Guys in my heel bay, Jesus. Okay, all right, so at least we, we can get fuel from this guy, so that's a good thing. So we know the next fight is the real fight, so the only way to get scrap from them is to actually crew kill them. Which is really hard to do on this event. Really hard to crew kill on this event because... Um, <sighs> because that if you trigger an event once you do a certain amount of damage. And we got no fuel. Wonderful. Just, just amazing. Just amazing. Yeah, such teas, no fuel. Normal FTL things, though. No fuel in a rebel controlled sector. Let me go ahead and get this power. Act three shields if we need to. Nothing happens. Okay. We're responding to a distress call. Hey, you're that ship! Prepare to die! <laughs> no! Um, God, you have hacking. Wow, this guy's ship is insane. Okay. I gotta cloak his stuff here. I don't know what happened to my heavy laser shot. It just didn't go through. Fucking weapon hack, man. Fucking weapon hack. Fucking weapon hit. F this game. Okay. That is piling down. There's a fire. It's good. God damn it. This ship is so fucking strong. I'm just probably dead right now. Honestly. Oh, this is so terrifying. I might actually need to let him leave. I don't even know right now. Can't do any damage. Jesus Christ. Hacks my weapons and he has a missile. So GG, I just lose. God damn this effing game. I swear, this is such bullshit. This is the second time. Is this the second run we're going to lose during a just running away, running out of fuel, stupid bullshit event? His fucking drone just blocked my shot, too. I really hate this game. I really, really effing hate this game. That was such a bullshit overpowered ship right there. It won't double pursuit because this is us. This is us with a distress beacon on right now. It's not double pursuit. It's just us getting RNG effed again. Three drones, missiles, two lasers, hacking. Is that even possible in such an early sector or fair? Well, definitely not fair. It's 100% possible because we just saw it. <sighs> sector five, honestly, it's not that early.
What's up, Britain? Oh, yeah. I mean, it's I don't, this is a common theme of me running out of fuel, and I'm not even doing crew kills this time. So I don't know what the fuck is happening lately with me running out of fuel every goddamn effing bullshit FTL run I play lately. I bought fuel at the last store. I didn't. I gave away two fuel for one event. I don't know what's happening with this shitty game lately. Like seriously, I don't. I, I've I've gotten like six free weapons, and I'm out of fucking fuel. God damn it, this game is so frustrating, I swear. No, I'm not renaming any crew right now because I'm about to die, so I'm not doing that. Not renaming crew when I'm literally about to die. Yes. Get me the fuck out of here, man. Wow, these ships. Okay. Excuse my language, but this is the kind of crap that just makes me hate my life. Makes me hate my life every time I every time I have to play FTL on Wednesdays. We have amazing weapons, but can't get a single piece of goddamn fuel. Thank God, Jesus Christ, game. Oil prices constantly on the rise recently. Maybe that explains why they're so low on fuel. Yes, I'm sure. I'm sure that is the reason. So this is the NG quest. We got a free repair after the quest, after this quest, which is great. But, I don't know if I'm surviving that long or having enough fuel for that long. Yeah, even the surrender offer had no fuel, yeah. Okay. So crew killing is the only way to get rewards from this event. This guy can literally do no damage to us, so that's good. That guy just dodged like 60% of our shots. F this effing, effing piece of shit F game. Just F it. I can't, there's no fucking counterplay to 100% fucking dodge, man. He just gets out. He just fucking gets out because he dodged 100% of our volleys. How, how the hell am I supposed to play a game like this? Like, seriously. What the fuck am I supposed to do? No shields, and he dodges... So many shots that I get one shot through with. One, two, three, four, five, six shots. That is, what is that, 80% dodge? How the hell do you play a fucking game like this? I am so... Ugh. I hate this game. I hate this game. Oh, uh, fuck it, free borders. Why not? Why the fuck not, man? damage too. F you. It's so dumb, man. I just... 
Now I don't even get the free repair from the NG event. Why? Because they had 80% dodge. Like what is, how, how, how do you, what do you, what do you do when the game does this to you? There's like, there's nothing you can do, man. You don't know if anything could have done better. What would the other weapons? Didn't buy our soul change. Had a bad streak of bad luck. Maybe I should have hacked that. The guy's running the way he's piloting. That would have guaranteed three shots got through. I guess that was the only play. But if they have three shields, usually I find it better to hack shields than piloting. I don't know. Man. I don't fucking know. Gotta go to the store. I don't know, man. Doesn't matter how strong you are. That doesn't counter FTL effing you in the A. Aim harder, you know. Fuck you, FTL. Fuck you. Stop taking my fucking fuel, man. Look at this ship's weapons, by the way, too. Uh... Hey, what do you know? He's running away. Why do I get so mad? I don't know why I get so mad. I should have hacked his piloting. I just should have done it. Oh, thank God. Only his missiles online. Good. I was afraid I would not take four damage. God. God. Uh, I guess I need to start hacking piloting rather than shields. I guess that's the play. I get guaranteed three shots through if I do that. Hack piloting shoot shields is probably the correct play. God damn it, you stupid rock dude. Walking through and getting yourself vented. You've never seen Factorio make me mad like this. True. Factorio didn't make me mad like this. It's very true. We're diving again because I had to go to the store for fuel. Hey, look, we actually got this, though. Well, that's amazing. All right, let's do this. You are right. There are many games that don't make me mad like this. I should probably play those games more. Hey, what do you know? I got zero effing dodges. Big goddamn surprise. Oh, man. Well, let's see what great reward we get right before we die from our dive. Oh, <laughs> wow. An actual Vulcan, huh? Good reward. Good reward. I hope I can survive to either get it online or sell it. What's up, Nietzsche? This should give us an extra non-dive jump. Uh, you might be right about that. Oh, nope, it doesn't. Okay, dive. I guess we're just all in on the engines then. We do have cloaking and hacking. I'm just gonna hack your weapons. Okay. Alright, zero damage dive at least. Let's go try to find Zoltan's shield. We'll probably die in the Zoltan homeworlds to, you know, 
Zoltan Border Police, but hey. This has been a has been our kinda edge of the just edge of the seat run this entire time. If I got third shield, I'd actually be in pretty good shape right now, honestly. Get 20 scrap to get level 2 piloting. As long as I don't get hit in the guns, isn't a Vulcan stronger than my current setup? It's, um... It's a slower version of my current setup. Vulcan takes a long time to spin up. This is a 1 in 4 to lose crew. Vulcan is really good when you have good defense, and my sh my shields not being level 3 is, in my opinion, a not very good defensive setup. So. If I get third shield, yes, I might swap over. Okay. Hack the piloting. Do it correct this time. Hack piloting, shoot shields. Cloak the ion, probably. Maybe it would have been better to hit piloting instead, but this seems pretty good. Good dodges there, though. Get at least one of these things offline. Okay, good. See, if I had Vulcan up there, he the we probably wouldn't have even be, been fully spun up by the time we killed him, so... Vulcan is good in long fights, not that good in short fights, if you can kill them quickly. God. Okay. Whew. Speaking of Vulcan. I'm just gonna do this. Nice. Huh, can I crew kill this? Fire in both of those rooms. Nah, he's too low on health. I'm trying to run. What's up, Box Type? Beating that Cope all as well? It's been a pretty rough run. We are alive, though. I've been raging, but, you know, what's new? Normal FTL stuff. Even the pirates run around with Vulcans in this version of the universe? Yeah. So I'd love mind control. Do I have anything? I do have two things to sell if I want to sell the Vulcan. Which I might do. I might actually do that. God, this weapon system. One, two, three, four, five, six, or seven power weapons with three shields. Terrifying weapon system. All right, we got the burst laser two offline. Nice, nice. Man, it feels good to take out their weapons and not let them do any damage. Feels really, really freaking good. Do 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 All right, I shouldn't have got so mad earlier. I shouldn't have got so mad. We're we've recovered pretty well. We almost have enough for third shield. Although I'm hoping to get mind control and backup batteries. I don't know if I'll get the third shield yet. On that day, Iran's heart grew four sizes as you realize that hacking piloting is so OP. It is when you have a flak. That's true. First laser two. Wow, there's two systems I want, and neither of them are in this store. Okay. God, I feel like the first laser two is a bait. I'm going to 
take the bait. I'm not going to get it online because I need third shield next. But we're going to go third shield, then we'll go for the burst laser 2 online. Nope, I don't want that. I need scrap right now or Zoltan Homeworld's quest. But I do know of at least three very long fights coming up. I already have good weapons, but the Vulcan can help you against them. Mothership, I guess, is MS. Uh, but I'm not so good at judging, at judging scrap opportunities. Yes, we got Zoltan Shield quest. We don't even have to dive for it. Um, Vulcan is very good. It is very good. This is not a situation where I think I want to use it. I will definitely use Vulcan when the situation calls for it. What I have here are four very fast, high-impact weapons. Vulcan's slow. Vulcan is good when you don't have other weapons that are faster firing, firing with hacking. Problem is we have faster firing with hacking, so Vulcan's not as good in this situation, in my in my opinion. And there we go. Okay. We'll go ahead and get this online. That kind of makes up for us not having the shield up yet. Just get all the shots, I guess. Let's do it this way. I could get back a battery if they had that for sale here. Boo no envoy. Get out. Get out of my chat. Get out. Okay, taking this. And then all the fuel I can buy. Bum, bum. I'm probably going to dive here. Because I need extra scrap right now. Investigate. Nice. Um, don't really have any place to put you. Need sensors. I need so much scrap right now. Distress beacon. Yeah, I'm, I'm taking a dive right now. With cloaking and Zoltan shield, dives are a lot less scary. Save the Mantis ship. It's our only way to get extra rewards here. Cloak the uh, chain laser here. Very nice. What's up, Director Matthew? It's good to see you, my friend. How are you doing? Tuned in just to find a Zoltan shield? Sweet. That's right. Just in time for the Zoltan shield. Feels really good, man. This has been a been a run where I was down to about four health and no fuel for like five jumps, so I was definitely raging at that point. Okay. You hate to ask a third time to be the free Lanius. Okay, you want to be the Lanius, sure. Uh, after this free intruder fight, which I'm going to forget because, god damn it, this is... I don't have my control counter to this. Don't die, please. Don't have cloaking up. Okay, thank God. Jesus Christ, how many freaking borders do we have? Sorry, I have to... Jesus Christ, I'm about to lose my mind with these freaking ridiculously overpowered goddamn enemies, man. Holy shit. This is, this is, this is not a Mantis sector, right? How did I just get six, six Mantis borders in a non-Mantis sector? It's freaking Zoltan Homeworlds. I fucking hate Zoltan Homeworlds. All right, well, we have Zoltan Shield. All right, uh, somebody wanted to be the Lanius. Let me fix that right now. Jesus Christ. There, there you go. Crap. Christ on a cracker. Man, anybody want to know how this run's going? This is how this run's going. Fighting for my life every freaking jump to not lose crew, to not just die. 
What's up, JF JFK? They're the Mantis who identified themselves as Zeltons. I just became a Zeltan hero. Don't I feel accomplished? Not at all. Not even a little bit. FTL's a big D. Giving you the wonderful RNG with strong ships on Mondays. Screwing you over on Wednesday. But that's Nihil Novi. I don't know what that means. Honestly, I've gotten really good RNG for the weapons this run. But everything else has been just... I just have to freaking... Pull teeth to not die. Killing me here. Nihil Nobi means nothing new. Okay. That's a trade off. No chance of Zeltan Shield, but difficult sector. Sure. Sure. It's a trade off. I risk high reward. I guess so. Can't get the heavy laser online yet. I think I need like 75 scrap for that. Four shield ship. We don't have to cloak this because we have Zelda Shield. Beautiful. I think we actually get this kill, which I need the fuel. Damn it, if he had dodged one less shot. I think cloaking will be up for this, though. Beautiful. Yes, we definitely... Every little tiny bit of fuel is precious right now. Are you freaking kidding me? Double four Zoltan sectors. Sector 7. Oh, the sector layout has been just absolute trash this run that is this is apart from sector 7 abandon or sector 7 Zolt, uh, slug this is the worst op possible option this is probably worse than some of those options too carpe diem it means to carpe all them diems yeah cool god damn it rockman why are you so stupid don't run through this do I have anybody else trained in weapons? I kind of just want to get... Yeah. I'm sorry. We can't have a silly device. We can't have nice things. Because I, I just want to... I can't keep venting my crew every time I need to run through the weapons. So, you're indoors, sir. Seventy-five for the heavy laser. Okay. Zoltans are quite a powerful race in this timeline, having so many sectors under their control. Yes, apparently so. You treat each new FTL run as a different FTL timeline. Okay. Oh, I'd 100% rather have... Uh, wait, so close to Federation Homeworld. Okay, yeah. Um, what do I want to do here? We want just overwhelming firepower, so we're, we're saving up for the weapon upgrade rather than third shield right now. Oh, God, half power. Nice. Very, very nice. We're going to hang out, in the hang out in the nebula for hopefully lots of scrap. I could have gotten my weapon upgrade. All right. Our strategy is speak softly and shoot him with lots of guns. I'll need three nebulas to get two extra jumps here. Okay. Well, I'm almost out of fuel again. I'm sensing a theme in this BS game. Fuel is for noobs, I guess. All right, we're going to be hacking piloting here. No 
Cloaking no weapons. F you. Wow, you have teleporter too? Wow. No. Sucks to be you. No teleporting allowed. Ah, oh, God. I think I need to take a fuel deal. Screw it. I'm not taking it. Hopefully I get more from this. What's up, laner? Beautiful. One less fuel, a lot more scrap. Glad I took that. Gonna go here in case there's a store. That way I can go up through here and be more efficient. Hacking, cloaking, and flak. What else is good in life? Well, Zoltan's shield and mind control. Got one of those things. Just gonna keep hacking, piloting. Seems to be the correct play. Maybe my hacking shields all the time was a was a bad play all along. My heart growing three sizes or whatever you said earlier. Poke the flak. Double small bombs, eh? How are the runs today? Well, this is the first one, and I got pretty crazy salty earlier because uh, I was down to four health and, you know, no fuel again. Like, FTL just apparently has having a giant fuel shortage like it's freaking COVID or something. I don't know. Uh, if large boarding party comes into play, you'll probably lose. Honestly, Rand, you deserve a praise for withstanding RNG's BS. You'd be long dead in this run. Can't manage stuff on no pause for life of you. Well, that's why I get so frustrated, because even, even if I'm successful, I'm like... It's like pulling teeth. It's so, like, punishing the events. We've had so many, like, ridiculously overpowered ships with, like, you know, six boarding and multiple boarding events in a row and all that kind of crap, so... That's why it's been so frustrating. No, I haven't reset. All the bad stuff happened. I, I've gotten like six free weapons is the thing. So it's like a trade-off. I did not reset though. Did not reset. Better wait for the cloak. Emotional roller coaster is world famous levels. There you go. That's that's what I'm known for. Being an emotional wreck. Can't handle all the stress, man. I can't handle all the stress. Oh my god. I'm I'm like literally George Costanza. An Oscar winner, Jerry! An Oscar winner! Okay. There's a store. Let's see what's in the store. Maybe you're, you're you're used to Hollow's crazy fast runs. I thought Hollow played really slow. Damn it! Where's my freaking mind control, man? Alright, we have one more chance at mind control. Let me get sensors. If I do this, I would still have enough for mind control if I get at least one more scrap jump. But if I don't get mind control, I'm gonna want clone bay, so. I'll get here in four, so I'm gonna not spend scrap on fuel, because I have exactly enough to get mind control right now. Rand can't reset. Resetting equals surrender, and we never accept surrender. <laughs> That's right. To be fair, I'm basically fighting epic levels of bull and RNG Jesus has not accepted my cookie offerings yet. I guess that's true. I haven't vented enough humans is my problem. Don't cloak this because we have Sultan Shield. A one hour run is slow according to Hollow. Okay. All right. How do you get a 92 streak if an hour run is slow? I don't get that. You don't even give yourself chance for crew training, and I'm. But I don't know. I don't watch 
other players, so I don't know. That just doesn't sound like what I've heard of the way that Hollow plays. He only does street fast streaking lately. Okay. Well, I believe you. I, I, you know him better than I do. I believe you. I just, uh, he, he's playing differently now than I think he used to. Then I guess. Did I fail that? I failed that. I don't think you're making stuff up or anything. Nope. But Rand, you had no fuel. Why don't you take the fuel deal? Because I don't want to. We got a store next jump. I'm hoping for more scrap. Beautiful. 57 scrap. Besides, as long as there's three fuel here, we'll have enough to get out. We're being perfectly efficient with our fuel right now. Mind control. That's what I want. Beautiful. Um, that'll be like a double dive if I did that. So I'm just gonna go one, two, three, and out. So I do need one more fuel, actually. Perfect amount of fuel. Do I buy crew? Nah. Crew's good, especially now that we have mind control. Now we just need third shield and we're boss ready. Would they be so stupid and unfair and cheating? F you, FTL. You kill my clone bay, you piece of shit. Zoltan borders. Stop with the damn dodges, man. F U F T L get wrecked. Holy free scrap recovery arm. <sighs> FTL needs an AI voice that comments on what's happening in a sarcastic way. Okay. Guess we have another shitty event like that. Let's refresh our crew. Man, thank God for Clone Bay. I I think if we had Heal Bay, I was probably guaranteed to lose one crew there with them boarding in my damn Heal Bay. Holy crap, F U F T L man. All right. Alright, at least no boarding this time. We have the mind control counter. Your weapons are insane, by the way. Screw your weapons, you don't get to have them. <sighs> 94 scrap, but I can't spend it because we're at an asteroid field. I just need power now. We're honestly looking really strong now. Um... Shields for you. 
Save this. My control for the counter. My god, we had to fight tooth and nail for every little bit of stuff we've earned this run. Nope, screw your deal. Zoltan Pirate has insane weapon system, Rand, with his weapon system and cloaking. No, that's right. Oh, that was a nice double reward. Four shield slugs in the Zoltan sector checks out. Just FTL things, that's right. Just FTL things. And a five Mantis boarding ship in Zoltan sector, again, checks out. You needed another reason for why Zelton sectors are the dumbest sectors in the game. Those two things right there. Zelton sectors with slug and mantis boarding that is scarier than actual mantis and slug sectors. It's just insane. I'm going to see a fight like this as a movie. Two ships full of guns and an asteroid field waiting for the Zelton shield to be wheeled down by asteroids and then going to town. Okay. Where does the doge thing come from? Mods? Or is it possible to replace the files or something? Yeah, it's a mod. Type exclamation point. Uh, FTL ship. And there'll be a box.com link for uh, where you can get that mod if you're interested in it. It's called Dumble Doge. Thanks to Ren in the chat if Ren is here for that. I'm trying to decide. Yeah, we still want this. Ren is the creator of the Dumble Doge. The Dumble Doge. Offer my assistance, scan the planet, fail. You can visit Zoltan sectors without ever encountering an actual Zoltan, I know, right? Something's wrong with this situation. Get out, macroed, sir. Microed, whatever. Do -do 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 -do. Get blasted. Whew. Nice double reward. Now the question is if we go to repair. Because if we take a repair, more chance that we have to dive before the base. Our build's probably strong enough that it's probably worth it. And I'd like the drone parts from the repair too. I won't go double repair. I think that's too greedy. Crew kills? Nah. Just two shot him. Parts nice. Okay. Do I think I ever get fourth shield here? I don't think I even need fourth shield, so I'm just gonna go for value points. The Zoltan shield and cloaking. Fourth shield's not definitely not needed for this run. Pair equals less scrap. Well, only if you get a whole bunch of other jumps, and it's not like I was gonna get a whole bunch of other jumps without going to the repair. So I, I disagree with that thought. Taking one repair, I think, is not going to make it so that I missed out on, like, a whole bunch of other jumps I could have taken. I mean, if you look, I can still go one, two, three. Uh, just it, It's just completely random. If... To me, not taking a repair, hoping to get more jumps in the last sand sector is is like gambling on the lottery. You, you never know which jump's going to get taken over anyway. So just get as many good jumps as you can. Um, and there's no there's no guarantee that it, when I don't have long range scanners that these jumps that aren't repair stations are going to be ship fights either because there are empty jumps in the final sector too. So repair station to me is guaranteed scrap. One more Zoltan shield, do a perfect amount. It's like that, uh, what's that event where it's like you can either use them to delay the rebel fleet or just destroy them for scrap? I always say destroy because guaranteed scrap is worth far more than potential scrap in my opinion.
If you're new to the game, dig boss owner, why not double repair station? Um, to me, I felt that was too greedy because it was further away from the base and it gave more chances that it might cause us to have to dive. Because the longer you take to get to the base, the longer, the more, every, every turn you take in the final sector, another two jumps get taken over. So I felt it was too greedy to take both. We've gotten lucky that the path we've taken has not had any forced dives in it, and I felt getting a second second uh, repair station that was further away was too greedy and would result in us potentially taking a dive I didn't want to take. Thank you for the follow. Uh, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. You see how far away that is? Every jump we took was another chance that this, this, or this could have gotten taken over, which would have been a dive. It turns out we could have gotten those two, but I still think that my route was the more balances chance for reward with potential punishment, basically. It's like the D&D &D spell that makes your next attack have advantage. Why roll twice on one attack when you could just attack twice? Yeah. It's a good good comparison to eventually all the beacons except for the base will get taken over. Every jump will be a dive. That's right. You're basically gambling. Every extra jump you take is a chance at possibly having to fight a really strong overpowered ship with an anti-ship battery firing at you at the same time. You forgot about the ASB? Yep. Sincere gratitude. You know what you can do with that gratitude? You can uh, wrap it up in a nice bow and I'll put it on my mantle to show all my friends. Look at all this gratitude I have. It's like all the people who pay singers in exposure. Wow. I'm going to go buy dinner with all this exposure I have. All right, that's going to be $15.20 for dinner. I have exposure and gratitude. Will you take this? No, we only take real currency here. Oh. I guess I shouldn't have taken that exposure and gratitude as payment from all those people. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Not clicking this because we got exactly three Zeltan shields up for that. I'm waiting here because I want them to be in here to mind control. Nice. Oh, the weapon hack. Oh, uh, this is probably still fine, though. Probably. We have fast firing weapons. Is it going to be fine? I don't know. Okay, we've gotten a couple crew kills. All right, that is, wow, that's some really good crew kills. And that, my friends, is why hacking shields will always be, almost always, be my chosen way of killing the boss. Damn it. Uh, okay, I'll die. Unless he dodges, okay. Heavy laser plus hacking and shields and a single fire just does work, man. But money is such an ugly topic. Let's not talk about your payment. That might be slightly awkward. <laughs> You're just trying to make excuses not to pay me, aren't you? No, no. I highly, highly value the service you're providing. Just not highly enough to actually give you anything of any value. I find your service so valuable that money can't put a price on it. The only price I can put on it is something that's worth nothing. So, you know... That's how I feel about your services. Thank you for the follow, Dig Boss Owner. Mm. Yeah, it was a perfect phase one, honestly. Only way it could have been better is if I had done two more, uh, two, gotten two more crew kills.
Worthless and priceless are essentially the same thing, after all. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> pretty much. Do, 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 do. Okay, no more missiles. If I can get one more crew kill, I'd be happy. Perfect. Beautiful. So we got, uh, I think, one border left for the final phase. I find your service worthless. I mean priceless. That's totally what I mean. Used to have a boss who delayed payment when you asked for it. He was like, don't focus on money so much. Don't you like work itself? And that's when you immediately quit that job. It's like when... Um, oh, I was thinking of something this morning. Um, oh, what was it? Oh, it was like when people ask me, Rand, why do you stream FTL? Is it just for the viewers? You shouldn't stream it if it's just for the viewers. It's like... Yeah, I guess so. But let me ask you, why do you work? If it's just for the money, why do you work? You shouldn't you shouldn't work if you don't if it's just, just about money. I mean you you gotta you gotta you gotta make some choices. You know if they aren't the optimal ones, even if I get salty as hell while playing this game, people still watch me play it, so I gotta <laughs> get salty play this game if I want to actually do it for a living, you know. You quit faster than light, yeah. Yeah, I don't blame you. I've done that once or twice. I have rage quit faster than light because of how ragey it makes me. You should work for what makes you happy. Poor people. What? If you could get away with it, you wouldn't work at all? E exactly. That's... And I'm probably about the closest... Like, streaming... Playing games as streaming is probably about as close to that as you can get. However, people who say that streaming isn't work have never done it. But it's still about the best work you can do that's, you know, actual work that you can get paid to do, you know. There it is. It's people who don't think streaming's works have never tried to do it five, six, seven days a week. Perfect cloaking timing. Beautiful. This is looking like a two or three damage boss fight, maybe. Do, do, do. GG cookie time. One in a row with a slug A. This, uh, this win was way more difficult than it should have been with how many free weapons we got. Imagine getting salty at a game that wasn't even good, though. Could be worse. True. It's true. I'm getting salty at one of the best games ever. So there is that. It's a good point. Check that score. 5685. Let's have a cookie. We earned it with that crazy run of no fuel, all the weapons, and ridiculously strong enemies. If you had to stream for four to six hours, you'd start hating gaming. Well, that's the other challenge when you do something like something you love as a job is not getting burnt out on that thing. Great thing, thing about gaming, or at least for me, is you can always just play another game. So. That's why I play other games, because I would 100% be burnt out on FTL if I was not, if I was playing it more than two or three times a week. Literally just join to see the flagship. Perfect timing. Um, you will never be salty again since you got a free pre-igniter yesterday. <laughs> you say that now. Just wait till a breach missile hits your weapons while somebody's running away and then you die to a fire. I'm pretty sure that'll make you salty. What you love is working out and sex. Can you get paid? Yes. There's called the porn industry. Pretty sure if you go into that, working out and, you know, that's, that's pretty much all you do, I think. But I don't know, it's probably a lot of work too. 
<laughs> it's probably a lot of work, and there's stigma that goes along with that, I'm guessing. All righty, my friends. Well, that is one win in a row. Starting a new streak on the Slug A. If this goes anything else like all of the other uh, revisits we've had, um, probably I will win one more and then immediately die. So... But you're too ugly for that. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alrighty. So before we do the next run, my friends, I'm going to stand up, stretch, use the restroom. Thank you all so much for watching. If there's anybody new to the stream, hope you're having a good time. If you are, hope you have to follow. Quick 60 second stand up, stretch break. We come back. We'll do slug A again. See if we can get two in a row and not die. Y'all rock. See you in a bit, my friends. <laughs>